Welcome to Utah. <laughs> Hi there, it's Claire from Clarified Creations, and today is travel day. I am so happy to announce this, but I'm going to be one of the people attending the National Student Nurses Association Conference in Salt Lake City, Utah. I'm really looking forward to this plane ride, even though it's not that long from Knoxville to Salt Lake, but I am very, very just ready to be on a plane. I haven't been on a plane since May of 2019. If you're new to my channel, hi, I'm a second semester nursing student and I'm at the University of Tennessee. I make videos all about nursing school, lifestyle, and just some fun, crazy adventures I have with my friend Sarah here and there. Look guys, I have a suitcase and a backpack behind me. That makes me so happy. For those of you guys that are in nursing school, I am not alert and oriented times three because I didn't get really hardly any sleep. I'm a member of Precious Prince and three people from the College of Nursing are going to represent Precious Prince. Basically, it's a organization that is run by UT students at the College of Nursing and we provide free fingerprint pendant charms to families that have lost a child. So in the event a child is lost, we will supply hospitals with print kits to give to them free of charge and we do fundraisers to support this project. I, it's still so early. I can barely think, guys. But anyways, enough of me talking. I'm going to try and get as much footage as I can this week, and we'll just kind of see where this vlog goes. <music> about to board the flight to Salt Lake. It's a four hour flight and I think I have an aisle seat which is sad but that's okay. Guys, I'm at the place where High School Musical was filmed, East High School in Salt Lake City. <laughs> this is like my childhood dream to come and see this place. And we're here at the same high school. So exciting. So we might even be going inside. Update, we are going inside to a real school. Look at this. <gasps> High School so Music, so man. So <gasps> Guys, there is Zac Efron, wow. <gasps> High school musical. This is the cafeteria. This is just really This is crazy. Yeah. This is a real school, you guys. Like <gasps> We should really go. Hi, let's go. <laughs> oh my gosh. There's actual students in here too. I feel like we're kind of disrupting. But we <laughs> if this vlog makes no sense, it's because I'm in shock. Cafeteria chairs right here. Just casually roaming the halls. Oh, we're going towards the gym. <laughs> we're going towards the gym and the theater, and possibly gonna go try and find Sharpay's locker. But we These have them are Sharpay's lockers. Oh my gosh, stop. Wow. That's so Sharpay Evans right there. And we're gonna go see the auditorium now. Unfortunately, the gym was locked, which was really sad. Okay, they're having practice, but we're gonna go in anyway. Update, 
Flight 2.0. We are now in the auditorium. Here we are. This is the most iconic. Wow, look at that, guys. This is the auditorium that High School Musical was sung in. And there's just random people that are thinking, what are you guys doing? Wow. So now we're gonna be leaving East High, home of the Wildcats. And this is the view of the mountains on that side. And I'm currently sitting on a bench just thinking about my childhood. So comment down below if you guys have seen High School Musical and which movie is your favorite one. Mine is definitely the first one. It's such a good movie. Good morning guys, I'm sitting in the hotel lobby about to do my research class because I completely forgot about it until last hour and it's 6.50 here in the morning, normally it would be 8.50, research starts at 9 Eastern but since I'm on mountain time I had to get up kind of early but I was already up so it really didn't matter but yeah I'm starting to kind of not be on top of school but thankfully I remembered that I had class today so I'm not going to be skipping it or anything like that. I don't even know where I left off yesterday, but we're going to go to the convention today because it starts pretty soon in a few hours after my class. We'll go there and I'll try and update you as much as possible. But here's a sneak look into our Hilton Hotel. We're at the convention now and wearing a t-shirt and a cardigan and everyone else is wearing business casual, businessy attire. We decided to go to H&M because we're all really underdressed. And we also got these really cute ribbons. It says poster presenter on it, it's very official. But everyone is dressed in suits and slacks and really nice shirts. I don't think I'm gonna be buying anything here because there really isn't much that I'm seeing. Is it over? Seven forty-one. Here we see empty rows because everyone left. <laughs> oh, oh, he sees us. I know who you are at the first night party. He knows who we are. Dr. Davis, thank you for sharing your insight with us and showing us how to make. A We're at the fifties themed party now. There's not very many people here, so I got some pineapple and watermelon and chips and salsa, and the pineapple is really, really good. It is day two. There's so much going on, and I'm not really able to vlog too much while I'm in the sessions because the way this conference works is you go to a bunch of different lectures and everything and they teach you stuff or they'll just talk about a certain topic and you'll go in. So currently the group is at another session and I'm going to work on homework because I want to do some other sessions as well but I'm kind of feeling a little bit stressed about all the homework that we have to do and I'll also show you guys our poster because we are going to be presenting a poster today. That's why I'm sort of in a little bit more professional clothes than yesterday. Short story, we did not dress accordingly and we went to H&M and I decided to just work with what I have because I do have a couple more professional-ish looking outfits. And yeah, that's the plan. And also today, my hair is being crazy, but it's new. Go to two or three more sessions and then I will be presenting the poster with Eliza and Olivia. I was kind of falling asleep earlier, not really, I was just doing homework and I was super tired so I got some coffee before the next sessions. I saw some free food in the convention area where they have all the posters set up and there's a bunch of different schools. Even UT is there. We have one of our faculty that is going to be promoting UT. They have schools from all over the US which is really cool.
update. We're gonna be riding in the Tesla from our Uber. It's a Model 3 orange version. And we're changed into more casual clothes because we're not gonna be in that for too long. We're getting dropped off of the In-N-Out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're going to In-N-Out Burgers. Uber ride down here in an orange Tesla. And we're at a very fancy restaurant. In and out has been secured. We got the plain hamburger and some fries. Just casually walking around with a swimsuit cover up on in the middle of Salt Lake City because. Our hotel is weird and the stairs did not lead to where we thought they would and we ended up outside instead of inside by the pool at the hotel. We tried the pool but it was way too cold. Heading down to the conference for day three. This is the OOTD, a purple top. Got my badge on and it starts at nine, so I better hurry because it's currently 8.45 and we have to walk there. Eva's Bakery and I don't think I've ever tried an authentic macaron from an actual bakery. I know my mom's made them. I could be wrong. Let's try it and see. It's a lemon one if you haven't gathered that already. Mm. Wow. I can understand why everybody loves macarons. These are so good. I might just be coming back to the bakery tomorrow because I saw chocolate croissants there too and those looked really yummy as well. So I know no one asked for this update but this is probably the best macaron I've ever ate in my life. Mm. It has lemon curd in it too. I'm on the last bite. I'm going back tomorrow for sure. Mm. So I just got an alert on my phone from the NSNA app that they were handing out free snacks so I went downstairs to check it out got myself a free pretzel and they had cheese too but I figured eh, pretzels just enough I don't need the cheese on top and it's okay it's a little tough I feel like this vlog is gonna just be me continuously eating hi guys I'm actually back here at the hotel I kind of just decided all of a sudden that I wanted to come back here and just rest for a little bit take it easy because it's been go 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 for the past few days and I'm sort of tired I'm a bit dizzy too not really sure what that's about. At 3.30, I am probably looking forward to this one the most. It's about the joy of oncology nursing. And if you've been following my channel for a while, you know that I want to be a pediatric oncology nurse. So I'm super interested to see how that session goes and what they talk about. And I'm hoping that they're going to share some really good information. One more thing, guys. I forgot to show you what goodies I got. I got this really cute, sorry, it's a little bit crooked. There we go. This really cute future nurse tote bag, and it's from Simple Nursing. So if any of you guys are also nursing students, and apparently his name is Mike, and he's super famous on TikTok and Instagram. I feel like I've probably heard of him, but I've never watched any of his videos. Apparently he has almost 300,000 followers on Instagram, so super famous. We waited in line for probably 30 minutes to get this free tote. And then it came with a cute little matching t-shirt that also says the same thing. Ah, future nurse. Currently heading out to the oncology session now. Good morning. 
morning everyone. Today is the last full day and heading to Eva's Bakery to get a nice chocolate croissant and a small coffee because it just sounds so nice. And I thought, you know what? It's the last day. Let's go out for breakfast because I've been eating breakfast bars. So that is what I'm going to now. I don't know why I'm so out of breath. Probably because I'm carrying a 20 pound backpack full of unnecessary items. are here. I think everyone had the same idea because I see people from the conference too. But I'm going to be waiting for that croissant because I want the full experience. That was the best croissant. I know I keep saying this, but I am serious. That chocolate croissant oh, makes me want to go to France. I have to go to France now because it was just delicious. It was buttery and flaky and warm and the chocolate was just oozing out of it. Oh. Can you tell the chocolate makes me happy and bread? It really doesn't take much to make me happy. I love food so much. I feel like a real adult too because I went there by myself and just kind of sat down and enjoyed a nice peaceful morning. But the conference center right there behind me and I'm going to go in and probably do a little bit more of their booths. They have some booths set up and I want to just talk to some people and then do some homework and get ready for the first session of the day, which is at 1045. And it's called Stop the Bleed, which is basically what it sounds like in emergency trauma, trying to stop the bleed. So they're going to do like a, a demo on how to do it. So it should be super interesting. And yeah, that's the plan. up leaving the conference a little early and we're at the Salt Lake State Park. We're gonna go see the lake and the mountain views. So I'll take you guys on a little bit of a tour. It's really, really different compared to the city where there's so many high rises and then in the middle of it, you've just got mountains on one side and then the lake. Like, mountains, lake. Three sixty mountain views right here. And here you see the birds chirping. Chirp. I'm currently walking along this whole area and the further I walk, the saltier it smells. I smelled it a little bit, but now I'm getting full on saltiness. It smells kind of like the ocean, but <sighs> it's beautiful guys. Okay, you're rolling. Hi! Hey, 
<laughs> Welcome to Utah. <laughs> Welcome to Utah. Hey, we're at the Great Salt Lake. Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Leaving Salt Lake. One or two sausages? Uh, just one. Thank you. All right. I got a brat in the fried potatoes. It looks Ooh. so good. <laughs> I got sauerkraut and a German pork steak and a brat. Wow. And then I got a brat and the hot potato salad. Going to the airport. Yes, <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> You guys want to be in the vlog too? Go back. Yes. Yay. Taking one for the team. <laughs> That's our luggage. Our bags. I'm heading back home. The lines are much longer than Knoxville, so you can see it's going all the way down there to there. We just boarded the flight and we're headed to Dallas. you guys we're in Dallas Fort Worth and the last time I was here was almost three years ago when I got stuck and all those tornadoes happened flashback because I was vlogging that day there's another lightning storm behind me lightning so my plane was delayed another hour and a half and I'm just walking around the airport some <laughs> I'm running, trying to get on this thing, the gate E. I don't know where it is. I'm in terminal B. I need to be in a gate E. And I'm a little bit stressed. We at gate B. And I need to be at gate E, 37A, like right now. They already started worrying. So I'm going to try and make this. I'm not going to miss this. I'm going to try really hard and get there. I'm going to run fast. kind of here in the airport area looking around. We just have a two-hour layover here and then we have another layover. No. And then we get to Knoxville in a two-hour flight. So really almost done with the travel day. It's 11.06. What an adventure this whole conference has been. I am so thankful that God blessed me to be able to go on this trip and I could just really see him working. His beauty is incredible. The mountains and the landscape. It's amazing to see other parts of the country and I really have a passion for traveling. Just put me on a plane and I am just like a kid. I love planes so much. But with that being said, I need to get some sleep because <laughs> nursing school starts back again tomorrow. 8 o'clock in the morning on Zoom. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys are new, I'd love to have you and click subscribe to see more nursing content. I will see you guys later. Bye!